Unit 3 The Universe and the Solar System Lesson 1 Universe It is the wide and extended space that contains all the galaxies, stars, planets, moons, living organisms, and everything. Galaxies They are groups of stars that rotate together in cosmic space by the effect of gravity or we have another definition for galaxy they are bigger units of universe each galaxy has a definite shape according to the harmony and the order of the groups of stars in it for example this one is called Andromeda galaxy Scorpion Galaxy, Orsa Major Galaxy. As you can see, they have different shapes according to harmony and order of the groups of stars in it. Galaxies Clusters. They are groups of galaxies in the space. So, if we have group of galaxies, they are called galaxy clusters. The Milky Way Galaxy The Milky Way Galaxy is our galaxy, the galaxy that contains our solar system, in which old or large stars gather in the center, while recent or small stars are located in the spiral arms of the galaxy. Give reason 4. The Milky Way Galaxy is given that name because it appears in the sky at night as a splashing milk or a spreading straw. The Solar System It is the Sun and eight planets revolving around it. The Solar System is located in one of the spiral arms of the Milky Way galaxy, on the edge of the galaxy. All of our solar system is located in one of the spiral arms of the Milky Way galaxy. The Sun takes about 220 million years to complete one rotation around the center of the galaxy. The Earth. It is the planet of life. Light here. It is the distance covered by light in one year, and it equals 9.467 times 10 to the power 12 kilometer. The speed of light equals 300,000 kilometer per second. We can use these numbers to calculate the time taken by light to reach Earth. The light will cover the distance between Sun and Earth in 500 seconds which is approximately equals 8.25 minutes. Expansion of the universe. It is the continuous separation between galaxies. As time passes, the spaces between galaxies increases. This means that the volume of our universe is increasing. Or our universe is expanding. As you can see, the distances between galaxies increases. The origin of the universe. Cosmogony in ancient times. In ancient civilizations, there pleads that there is a fundamental difference between earth and heaven that not allow them to develop theories about universe and its origin. In the Stone Age, through myth which dominated the human imagination, ancient Egyptians and Babylonians assumed that there was a relationship between eternal universe and the multiple gods controlling it.
at both the Indian and Chinese civilizations. Astrology prevailed. Big Bang Theory since 1933. Big Bang Theory it is a massive explosion happened since 15,000 million years resulted in it all forms of matter energy and time or it is the expansion of universe and the merging of atomic particles forming helium and hydrogen gases Big Bang Theory stages the first stage through Big Bang, at the time of Big Bang, the process of expansion and the changing of the gas was born, components started and it continues to this day. Number two, through one second after explosion, the temperature decreased to about 10,000 million degrees. Number three, within minutes after the explosion, the atomic particles produced from explosion merged together, producing gaseous clouds of hydrogen and helium with a ratio of 75% to 25% respectively. 75% hydrogen, 25% helium. Number four, after 1,000 million years from the Big Bang, the gaseous clouds merged, forming homogeneous masses which will produce the matter of galaxies. Number five, within 2,000 to 3,000 million years from the Big Bang, the gravity held in gathering of more masses, forming ancestral galaxies leaving areas of empty space between them number six after three thousand million years from the big bang galaxies begun to form number seven after five thousand million years from the big bang our galaxy the milky way took its disk form with its spiral arms. Number eight, after 10,000 million years from the Big Bang, the Sun was born. Then the Earth and planets were created. Number nine, after 12,000 million years from the Big Bang, earliest life forms began to appear on the Earth. Number 10, after 15,000 million years from the Big Bang, the universe as it is now. What is the future of our universe? There are two theories explaining the future of our universe. The first one is called Open Universe Theory. Scientists see that there is no definite end to the universe. This means that our universe will expand forever. As you can see, the volume of universe will expand forever. The second theory is called closed universe theory. Scientists see that the universe will stop expanding and will begin to contract until it becomes very compact or very hot, preparing for a new big bang so our universe according to this theory will expand to a certain limit then it will contract again to form a new big bang and so on this is the end of lesson one thanks for watching